Hello? Hello? Is this him? Yeah. Hey, uh, I'm on Facebook in a, in a Saginaw uh, housing group, and somebody is in here posting your name, number, uh, address, and all this stuff about you. Oh, yeah. And you have bad bugs in your house, and yeah. you're a oh, bad yeah. landlord. Yep. Well, I just wanted to make sure you were aware of that. I would probably take some legal uh, some legal counsel or something for that. Yeah, I actually have uh, some things for tomorrow set up already. Um, okay. Or, There's 63,000 people in this group. Yeah. Well, the funnier part is that everybody thinks that he's a victim, and he is not a victim. Actually, he hasn't cleaned his room. He won't get rid of uh, stuff. He pulled a bear out of the garbage that had bed bugs from a room he sanitized and cleaned and put that into his bedroom. He pulled a what out of the trash? We had a our maintenance guy cleaned another room, a single room, and a guy had bed bugs when he left. And so we sprayed it, and then the maintenance man took a bear, big stuffed bear, and oh. threw it. Yeah, threw it in the garbage, and then Tibbs went and threw it. Um, Went and threw it, uh, you know, out of the, pulled it out of the trash and put it into his room. Wow. Well, that would certainly be a problem. Well, yep. He's also being investigated by the FBI for hate crimes on YouTube. If you want to look up Tibbs TV for his hateful rhetoric and slander. By the FBI? FBI, yeah. FBI. The real FBI has been looking wow. into him. You so, know, yeah, I, he sounded a little unhinged. That's why I wanted to call you. Yeah, he is definitely unhinged. But um, is my number's on there? Yeah, he's got your number, your address, uh, your name. Because I didn't see. I've looked at it all day. I haven't seen my name and my phone number. Uh, yeah, it's, it's in there. So, so yeah, it'd be great if you could respond. Uh, he's he's He is unhinged. He also says he's autistic. Or uh, uh, he says that he is, um, oh, he says he has Asperger's, but I don't think he really does. Um, I work with children with Asperger's. Um, so, yeah. Judging so, by this Facebook post, it sounds kind of schizophrenic. Yeah, I would say he's definitely bipolar as well. But he actually yeah, said that, makes sense. that if I came over and confronted him about not paying rent on Friday, that he told his caseworker that he was going to stab me and kill me. Oh, so that God. was Friday. So she was supposed to do a – she did called me on a duty to warn on Friday. And so now I'm – obviously, I was up north, so I was not even home for the week, so I didn't really care. But um, so on Monday or Tuesday, I have to go in and file reports on that as well. Talk about it. Terrible tenant. Yeah, super awesome. He's awesome. Well, I'm sorry you have to deal with that. Like I said, I just seen this on Facebook, and I figured I'd get a hold of you because this guy sounds kind of schizophrenic or at least unhinged. Yeah, I would, I would appreciate. Like the other thing is, if you want to comment in support, man, that'd be awesome. Because I mean, honestly, if I've given him a 30-day notice 60 days ago, and he won't fucking leave. I mean, I, I honestly want to stay out of it for as much as I can. I certainly don't want. Uh, this guy to have my name or anything like that, but um, I, I I did want to reach out and let you know. I didn't know if you were already aware of this or or not, so I wanted to make sure yeah. that you were. And yeah, like uh, I said, I gave, were... a, I gave him a I gave him a thirty day notice sixty days ago. He's so unhappy that sixty days ago he could have left, and he hasn't. Yeah, I, I I don't know anything about any of that. It, like I said, it it just sounds unhinged, and I I figured something didn't smell right with it, so I wanted to give you a call. I, I appreciate you calling, but yeah, my buddy called me this afternoon. and Was like, man, I'm reading this, and I know all the charity you do in town, and all the I'm in service groups, men's groups. I you know I am appalled that he calls me a chomo and a pedophile, and everything else like that. I work with kids. I teach swimming oh lessons God. with kids with disabilities at the Y. So it's like, bro, you don't, <laughs> you don't know who you're talking to because there's only people on Facebook would really believe that because if you look at the comments, people are like, oh, I'll come over and I'll, you can have that landlord come over, I'll confront them. And I'm like, man, you don't know who you're even talking to. Like I'm most, most, about the most balanced person there is. I would probably call the police if I were you. Well, I've got all that scheduled for tomorrow. I've 
screenshotted all of his stuff. I'm printing stuff out. I've got a folder of all of it. So. Well, that's super scary. I hope it uh, gets resolved quickly for you. All right. Thanks for calling. No problem. Have a good one. You too. Bye.